Hey guys, uh, I got a couple of requests to show people how to make the same filters that I use. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make the old time radio filter that I sometimes use for uh, live broadcast and that kind of thing. And the, you're going to need a couple of programs for this. The first one is called Reaper. It's a free program that you can find online. Uh, uh, but I trust that you're smart enough to figure out how to do that. It's no, that's Reaper, R-E-A-P-E-R, -E -E and you're also going to need a little driver called the VB Audio Cable, which is a recording device, if I can't find that for you. But if you bring this over, it shows that cable app, but VB Audio Virtual Cable, you, I trust you can... I trust that you're smart enough to be able to find that on your own. So, the filter. Well, first off, the filter sounds a lot like this. Hey, how you doing? And as you can tell, it has this nice little grit to it, and it's really interesting. At least more interesting than the uh, raw feed. So, let's switch this switch back this. on and this back off. There we go. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to double click on this space right here. And what that will do is it'll bring up a, an empty track. And once you've got this open, you're going to want to arm this for recording. You're also going to want to make sure that uh, it's listening to whatever microphone that you have set up. If you haven't set up your microphone, you're going to have to go to Options, Preferences. And over here on the left-hand side, you're going to see Audio and go to Device. And it should be your input for your microphone, whatever the, whatever that might be. Give you a stereo mix, hey. And then output to the cable. You could also output to, yeah, the cable. And what that will do is it'll actually pipe out the audio to the cable so that you can use that, the raw audio from this and input it into something like MWO or whatever other programs that you have that are listening. Okay, so you have that, you have it armed. You're going to want to turn record monitoring off. And, and what that's, what going, that's to going to do is, is it's actually, going actually going to echo, to echo you, you and you're going to, you're going to hear, yourself hear yourself multiple, multiple times. times. It's really, really weird. weird. But, but um, you're, you're, you're going to have to bear with that because as distracting, distracting as, it as it is, you need, you need to know it's working. working. Unfortunately, Unfortunately, I don't need to know it's working right now, so I'm going to turn that off. There we go. Okay, so, once you have this set up, you go to FX. It's going to bring up this window right here, Add FX to Track. And under All Plugins, the first thing that you're going to want to find is your distortion. And the easiest way to do that is go down to Filter, type in Distortion. And you're going to see three options here. You're going to want Distortion Fuzz. And it looks like that. And it sounds, sounds like this. this. Yeah, yeah, it sounds really weird. Let's switch that to stereo. There, there we go. And, and you can tell that you can, tell that you can already, already hear the background, background noise. noise. So we're going to dial this back to 10. And let me just bring up my settings from up here. Dial back, dial back to 10. 10. I'm going to go minus 10. And minus 17, so you can, so you can get some bad noise back, back in. Okay. Okay. Great. Great. So that's so part, that's part one. one. Next thing Next you're going to want is regate. Is re you're going to so go, go back to back this window. To this window. Tacos. Tacos. You want to clear, clear the filter. The filter. And go up to regate. Re Open, Open that. that. And what, and this, what is, this is, is it's a, a detector, detector input. input. So, so if you're, if you're talking, talking and you and raise, you raise this, up, this up, suddenly you can't hear yourself anymore. And the reason for this is you got background noise. So what you want to do is you want to set it at a level so that you can hear yourself when you talk, but not necessarily the noise of your computer. So you want to so put, that, put that, right that right about there. there. Okay. Okay. Now this, now will, this change will change depending, depending on who you are, who are and, and I'm listening, listening to this. That's really annoying. This will change it depending on your setup and the system that surrounds you. So you'll just have to figure out that as you go. 
And the last little bit you're going to need is the re-EQ, which is where most of the radio effect comes from. And for this one, I'm actually just going to copy the settings from my live one because that's a lot of work. Go to copy, paste. And what this is, is it's an equalizer, and it I have it basically set up to trim off everything below this point and above this point, and boost the center. And that now sounds like, like this. this. So that's so how, that's you, do how that. you do that. Yay! Yay. Look at Look you, at you, you bro. bro. Anyway. anyway. Once you have Once all you this, have set, this up, set up, make sure, make you're, sure listening you're listening to it. To it. That way you can hear what's going, what's going on. on. You get to bring it up to preferences here, and you've already seen this, but you got your cable input. If it's going on output, that's great. Click OK. okay. And if you and go if you over, go over here, here, back to your recording, recording devices, devices, you'll notice that this that thing's spiking, spiking up. up. I actually, I actually have, have this set to listen, listen so I can so hear, I can what's, hear going what's going through. through. Because if, if I turn, turn this off, I'll hear myself, myself, myself in more and more, and that'd be tragic. Okay. okay. Cancel, Cancel that. that. So now so you can now do you something, can like something like open up Netflix or online, and, uh, and uh, change the recording devices, devices to the audio, audio cable. cable. And, and once you do that, you can actually talk through this filter, and it'd be awesome. So, that's enough that's for this enough video. video. Hopefully, you can figure it out from here. here. And if you can't, you're retarded. retarded. And, and uh, um, that's, it. that's it. 